Welcome to Ravens Over. Please go to my channel, also hit the notification bell, and like this video, and please share. Welcome to Hey! What's up? What's up? What's up? How you doing? How you been? What's going on? What's good? Are you getting it in? Somebody getting it for you. What's going on, people? Okay, this is about MJ Rodriguez. Now, this story is being reported of October 30, 2019, a Newark Native Award winning transgender actress inspires local students. Now, I want to share this story with you as far as today. Now, a Newark, when the actress MJ Rodriguez came back to her native Newark hometown, she kept the audience of students from the City of Arts. Arts High School locked in with one word, love. My transness, my blackness, my Latinas. Everything about me doesn't make me different from nobody else, says Rodriguez, whose, whose transgender identity is a part of her role on a television drama pose. I show the love. I have my art and my work, and I always encourage myself to be stronger, and I encourage every teenager here to do so. Rodriguez's words of encouragement came out of the third space of a coal working center in the Ironbound neighborhood on Thursday night at the students of her from her arts high school alma mater. At a very young age, Rodriguez knew that she wanted to be a female as well as an artist. Making the transition into both of these aspects of my life wasn't easy. But the growth that comes through the change can be seen in her life. Now, Rodriguez is 28 years old, and she built her career on the foundation of her training in Newark at the New Jersey Performing Arts Center NJ Pack Youth Program at Arts High School. While studying at the Berkeley College of Music, she was cast in the Off-Broadway Wolf Broadway reveal production on the musical Rent. Rodriguez will perform as Angel Dumont. One of her the prestigious Clive Barnes Award in 2011. She last since Rodriguez has played the role of Bianca Rodriguez as as as, 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 as Evangelista <laughs> in the television drama pose set in New York City, African American and Latinx LGBTQ, a gender non-conforming ballroom culture since the 1990s, the 1980s and to the 1990s. The Global Globe nominee series include the largest cast of a transgender actors um, to be starred in the series regulars in the scripted show. Now, Rodriguez answered to the series of questions um, posed to be assembled in the arts high school students. Now, Xavier Jordan, visual arts, asked her if she used her work to advocate for social causes. Most people who are autistic, they call us everything in the book, but we're the ones who make things happen, especially kids of color, says Rodriguez, noting how arts create situation and automatically advocacy in its mere existence. But even when I'm going through the hardest times, I know that there was a bigger picture when I came to striving for what I wanted. Now, keep telling yourself you can do better. You deserve better. You're Dealing with issues of sexuality, gender identity, Rodriguez's advocate approach to influence of the standards of the late soul singer Sam Cooke. Now, try a little tenderness, Rodriguez says. Try to be understanding as they want to understand you. At the same time, Rodriguez, Rodriguez wants people to understand that like all people, that no factor determines who she is. I don't think of my gender identity makes me, I think I need myself. Rodriguez said in an interview, I think it is, has, I think it helps to hear from a woman like myself, who is a diamond in the rough. Just like many of the other kids that are here in Newark encouraged to constantly find who they are and be the person who they are. Arts High School Melissa Silva noted that the significance of Rodriguez return to her hometown for her students. I mean the world to see someone who was in their shoes that made it. Silva said, now, when it comes in, I saw that she came in, her, their face lit up. 
From Princess Arts High School class of 2020, Rodriguez visit opening to open her eyes and heart. She makes it wonderful what else is out there in the world. She gives us hope. Yeba said that the world is a scary place, but the only way that we can fight fear is with love. So I just want to share this though with you. And it's like a positive feedback and stuff because basically she's giving back. She's encouraging girls and, and guys to live in their truth and be in their dreams and, you know, lead with love and understanding this stuff because basically you got to kind of like be the teacher for people who really don't understand many things. So you have to have patience with people. And God bless you. She came from Newark, New Jersey, which is a wonderful thing, which is not that far from me. And um, God bless you. And, you know, it's a good thing to see the girls get back and stuff. And she's award-winning actress, MJ Rodriguez, who turned her native of Newark. You know, she's award-winning. So congratulations to you, MJ Rodriguez, even though you live right down the street from me. Anyway, I love you for your comments. Like this video and share this video. Let you know how you feel about this. When a girl goes to the top and comes back to get back to show her love, even on polls, she said, listen, I'm coming to open the door for you to walk through. That's one thing I love about a woman like her. There are many girls who've gone to the top that are trans that do not reach back to reach back to help their follow partners like the trans men or the trans women or the people that's in the LGBT and reach back in to help them. But basically the ones that's in the trans. It's good to see a trans woman. Not saying that's what she did, but it's good to see she reached back. Because a lot of times when trans people or even gay people get to the top, they close the, bar, the door behind them. They want to make sure that no one else comes behind them. So they close the door or maybe even push out negative feed because they don't want someone to push them out their spot. So afraid. But it is so welcoming and wonderful to see that a girl reaches back and says, Hey, before you close that door, let me pull a few more of my sisters and my brothers through. So thank you and kudos to you. And I love you, MJ Rodriguez. And I want you to know how you feel about this video. Comment this video, share this video. Let me know the encouraging words you want to share with her. Like I said before, subscribe to my channel at the top of this Instagram button. If you follow me, I'll follow you back. Let you I love you and thank you for watching. Kiss the rave.